welcome to Trade Happy, a community of traders learning how to be profitable and happy. Today we're going to be going over the charts and how to set up your charts to look like ours. So we would normally use either Trading View or C Trader. Um, today we're going to be going over C Trader and when you load up your C Trader chart, if you've got the default template. It would load up like this, but without the Treat Happy logo, of course. Um, so the first thing that I do to set up the charts is if you go into viewing options and you've got a list of things that you can have on your charts here and it loads in with all of them already ticked. Um, so I will get rid of a lot of them. Um, just to basically clean up the charts. So if you look at that already, it's a lot cleaner. There's a lot a lot less things on the charts. And if we get rid of these as well. So nice and clean. And then if we go on to indicators and you search for market hours. It's this one, but if you just open C Trader, it'll probably be down here and you'll need to download it. Um, so if you just click on that, and I only do New York and London, and I change that to blue, and then hit OK. And it'll load in like this, but then if you just hover here and drag it down, it can make it a lot smaller. It's a little annoying that you've got this space here, but oh well. And the next one is round numbers. So it's a custom one. And then if you just type in 50 pips and hit OK, it'll bring up all these lines which have a distance of 50 pips between them. Um, so it just hit, plots them onto the chart automatically onto any single chart that you load up using this template. Um, so that's the actual indicators and making the charts clean. Now for the actual colours. So for the background I normally do black. Foreground will be white. And then so I normally have a, a white outline for the bearish, uh, bullish I mean. And same for the bulls. And then you can choose whichever one you want. So if you prefer it to be the bullish ones black, obviously choose black, but if you prefer them white, that's basically the look that you'll go for in the end. And it will have just black and white candles. The reason for this is it takes, it helps with psychology, especially for newer traders if they're seeing green and red candles um, they might not look at the charts the same way than if it's black and white because they'll think of green and red in a certain way profit and loss um, so I found that it just it just helps to clarify the charts and the actual direction of the charts I'm not sure why that isn't fully black have a little look Colour options. Hmm. Um, okay, so you can change these ones as well. I've just left, left them the same because it doesn't really do much. It's just a red line here for a sell and buy. And then obviously the spread in the middle. Um, but yeah, and then on the... I know you can't see this, but on the left-hand side you've got all of your currency pairs just put in whichever currency pairs that you want to trade I go for the minors and the majors and that's pretty much it um, so once you've done that you can go into template and save template and it will just overlap any templates that you've already got um, so yeah that's kind of it it's a really quick video really super simple to set up the charts um, if you have any problems with it just put them in the comments below and I can answer them. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you did, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you next week.